Hey guys, Jota here. Now, you can see here, Pacific War. Now, as you can see, I haven't really touched it, so I'm just going to go with the Allies. Now, you can see here, I did buy, I did buy the premium, so I did actually buy the, um, the thing here. So I've got this. That's going to be my faceplate when I'm using the Pacific. You can see here, you know, Japanese and stuff. New research is available. What the fuck? Wait, what? I can get this already? That's interesting. Oh, that's very in. That's very interesting. So, by the looks of things, if you own the Pacific, you can you actually get access to a few of these off the bat. By listening, yeah, you get like the first. Um, yeah, for the rifleman, you got these off the bat. So yeah, I made a video on this, so you can see. Wow, yeah. So it looks like you get a few things off the bat. Like, you get riflemen basically off the bat. But I think this was the same with most riflemen. They just haven't implemented it. You also get tankers off the bat, which is quite interesting. But yeah, Pacific, it's in the game now. You can see here, I've got the Thompson squad. I am. Um, it's got the 20-round grip. Thompson, but that they look quite good. You also got the Type One. I am not. I am. Looks like the Nambu as well. So as for this, these in the high power. Whoa, that's pretty strong. Um, looks like an M55 right wing has been added as well, and a Type 100 is day one for day one um, things. You can see here. These are some of the weapons, the pistols, a new Smith and Wesson has been added for the Japanese as well. These are the new pistols. These are a lot of new pistols. You can see here a lot of new stuff, which isn't in the game yet. Um, looks like they still use. I don't. That's an American one. Because I, I don't really. Yeah, Type 11 and stuff like that. So that, that's a bit of a placeholder. This looks quite interesting though. Um, whoa! This is a 50. Holy shit! Yo, that's pretty good. Yo, that's actually really sick. The MP28 with a 50 round, this has got a 30. This is, this could be quite interesting. Oh, I'm looking forward to this campaign. You can also see as well the Japanese, they get a lunge mine. As well, they get grenades. A sword. Oh, this this looks really cool. Um, Oh, yeah. And as you know, the whole updates came out. Now, the, the whole, the thing hasn't came out yet. It's um, the, the whole, you know, the... Blog post hasn't came out yet, but but looks of things. Ooh. Okay, so I can get these because I've already got this maxed out. But yeah, it looks like I'm just gonna look through all of these now. Um, so for Normandy, it was the STG at level 88, 38. But looks of things, is it? What's the diff? It doesn't really have much of a difference between the MP43. Uh, I think it's got like a maybe a better rat fire. It has a better fire rate and better, maybe better recoil. Whereas the Thompson, let's see what the Thompson is. It's only the box. <sighs> I mean, it's a box Thompson, so it ain't going to be too bad, but I don't, I don't know. I don't see these are going to be too useful for Normandy. The Soviets, though, they're going to get some pretty cool stuff. They get the FA, which is quite cool, and the Axis get the... Finally get the MKB. The MKB, I think, will be a big changer for the Axis, but for the Allies... I think it is more making it into Moscow. They've really changed this colouring as well, as well. The colouring, the... Um, it's, it's a lot grainier. Uh, they also had in replays. I don't know what this bullet does yet. They haven't actually announced it. Uh, premium accounts. Oh, wow. That's really cool. Um, for the 30 days, you can actually get a bit extra. Save a bit more. Now, this one, they only added in the, this this noob tube mortar. It's only five rounds. I'm not really a fan of it. I don't think it'll be that good. But, yeah. I'm going to be doing a few things on the Pacific soon. So, yeah. Stay tuned for that. I think... Didn't they say they were going to add phosphorus grenades? Yeah, um, yeah, phosphorus grenade here. I don't know if they add it for the Japanese. Do they have the phosphorus grenade for the Japanese? Yes, they do have the phosphorus grenade for the Japanese. Okay, this looks quite interesting. They added in TNT charges as well. So that's quite interesting. Um, 
this looks like going to be an interesting campaign. So I'm going to be... I'm probably going to end up doing this. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Just a quick rundown of the Pacific. And I'll see you guys in the next video.